Hi, this is Vince with Discounting Board Marine. Uh, we're going to take a fuel pump that's not the original equipment for a Pleasurecraft Marine engine and we're going to install it with the original Pleasurecraft Marine fuel line. This is a metal fuel line that comes down. We already installed the new pump and you can see we're about an inch off uh, horizontally and vertically. So what you can do is just grab this fuel everything's tight we're tight at the carburetor and then you can just grab this fuel line and gently massage it down and you can bend it you can see we're almost there so now we just have to pull this out a little bit and bring it down a little bit and you can see as you work it we start getting closer and closer and you just keep working it until you can get this started into the fitting and once you do you just tighten it up sometimes you can use this one by one and get in between here this hose and the fuel line and maneuver it a little back or sometimes a little down whatever it takes to get this to line up and this pump is a dual diaphragm pump it's a marine pump it does not have the overflow tube. They decided that that was not necessary. So if you have a fitting on the carburetor for the overflow tube, you can just cap it. Or if it's on your flame arrestor, you can just cap it or just leave it open. It's just a vent. And once it's all tightened up, you're good to go. It does take a little, a little massaging of that fuel line. Don't get frustrated. Just keep working it slow and easy. And it'll work. It goes on. If you have any questions or we can help with anything, give us a call at 803-345-0996, and I'm Extension 3. And thank you very much for your time. I hope this helps. Bye.